Hi guys, welcome to your Divine Timing. The Divine Timing is a reading not based on Zodiac, but based on you, the time that you are watching this. However, these are not timeless reading. It only is in the perfect time. You got me, okay? So my readings are never, ever timeless anymore. I would want to see the future for you. If it happens in August, it happens in August. If it doesn't, let go. You got me, okay? So let's begin here. Okay, so the way I'm seeing here for you for the Divine Timing, Mm -hmm. I'm seeing here where you're trying to figure out what's the best way to... You're trying to solve the relationship in different ways, okay? So I feel like it's about to fall off, fall off, okay, or fall apart, okay? Um, you will find out um, in a very mysterious way, very mysterious way, that the person has been hiding someone from you, Okay? Now, as this is a divine timing, you already probably have a hunch. The guy, girl, or whoever you're seeing, whatever gender that they are, um, you have a hunch, okay? You kind of know, but you just can put, uh, you know, like the, the final T to it, meaning you want the receipts longer than the CVS. Mm -hmm. So I'm seeing here where it's a long distance relationship, okay? So if you're not in a long distance relationship, don't watch this. Mm -hmm. if, if you're not in a foreign relationship, don't watch this. My readings are very precise, okay? So meaning I just honed down to the few, okay? These are not timeless. But your intuition is telling you already this foreign, far person from you, okay, hasn't been honest, okay, lately. But... When you trace back, okay, because this is now you're trying to put things together. It's like, this doesn't make sense. That doesn't make sense. I wonder if they're seeing someone else. Now, in this divine timing, you will bring this to surface, okay? You haven't brought this to surface. You haven't, okay? You will. I see it here. You will. In the coming days, the time that you've seen this, you will. The person, yes, okay, has been entertaining. Will they lie about it? A big yes. Mm -hmm. Will you cut them off? A big yes again. Mm -hmm. The relationship that you have was so ideal for you. Mm -hmm. You feel you felt like this is it. We're going to move into the same house, the same state, you know, the same country, and then everything is going to be fine. But instead, it will go reverse, Okay. The person I'm seeing here, okay, has a tendency to, I feel like just, um, for them, it's like, you know, what you don't know won't hurt you. You know, they say, a diff, you know, if it's a different zip code, then it's not, you know, it's basically not cheating. Mm -hmm. If it's happening in a different zip code, you know, it's not cheating. You know? So this person has a very uh, twisted way, okay, of manipulating the situation. Okay, see, you got the Knight of Wands which is the one night stand card and the six of ones. The person that you're connecting with can travel for work also. Mm -hmm. Seven of swords with a star card always tells you the best thing that you will hear. Okay, but this is you basically becoming a brioche to the person. They're just buttering you up. You understand me? But as you are a queen of swords with a world card, again, this is, this is still a hunch. You haven't, you haven't, you haven't found out the photos. You haven't found out the Instagram account that they, seal, that they concealed from you. You haven't found out about, you know, who they're talking to. The six of ones, they talk to many, okay? So one from each state, one from each country. They're probably online, still swiping left and right while you don't even have an app anymore. But they have all the apps that you can imagine. Queen of swords, you will go in and investigate, yes? Four of Wands with the Four of Cups. I wonder if this is true. Four of Cups, right? I wonder if they're committed to me and they're loyal to me. You wouldn't question that if they were. This is what we call, if I were to go to the gender, the women's intuition. It never fails. It is 99.9.99. Okay. <laughs> you know. It's here. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't be here if the person is loyal and honest. Your mom already told you. She feels something's different. Are you okay? And then it's like, no, 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 everything is fine. But your mom also knows, intuition-wise. Are you okay? It feels like you're not. And other people, other women feels it around you. Are you okay? And you're like, yeah, 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 at work. It's always like, are you okay? Because you know you're carrying this on your shoulders already. 
at work, three of Pernacles. So that's what you've been doing. I just focus on my work. I ignore this. I ignore this, ignore that, whatever the guys are telling you. Ignore, ignore, ignore. Seven of Pentacles. I'm just waiting for a day where I will file for a divorce or separation of justice. I'm not laughing at the divorce. I want people to stay married. I'm a big, big supporter of the union. The union. <laughs> Seven of Pentacles with justice card. At some point, you're just saying here that, you know, everything hidden will come out. So justice is, you want the truth now. You want the clarity. You want equality mm -hmm, with the justice. You want karma to be served. Mm -hmm. Queen of Swords. You want to find out what they have been hiding from you. Okay. That's that. I'll continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below. As your intuition keeps telling you something. And then we will... Okay, see what is about to happen. I predict in the future, not your past. So it doesn't mean, this is not you. That, oh, this happened to me two months ago. They cheated. This is not you. This is for future. You've been cheated on already. Move on. Okay, this is different. Okay, I'll see you guys again. Bye.